Right, which one of you guys gets to come with me to Switzerland tomorrow? No, I'm kidding. Both of you can come. This is something that happens in all Indian households, uh, which is your mom coming in and wishing me for the journey. My mom is wishing me to come back as a winner. That's the whole plan. <laughs> Thanks, Amma. I really have no idea what to expect. I have been to Switzerland before, but never have I ever embarked on a series where I'm competing against other photographers to take the perfect shot. So like, no pressure. It's not like I spent most of my time like not trying to compare myself to other photographers, and now that's the whole reason I'm going. Jelly, bye. Thank you so much for a nice flight. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Bye-bye, thank you so much. Good morning, guys. I got into Zurich last night. I was way too tired to film at the airport, but today is the first start of the challenge. We're about to go downstairs and meet the entire team. I'm so excited to bring you guys along with me, and uh, I am pumped for this challenge, so let's go. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, finally. Love your work. Likewise. Good to meet you, man. So, this red envelope. Should we see what's inside? Yeah, yeah. Hands are shaking, I'm nervous. <laughs> Welcome to Switzerland, dear creators. Your adventure begins with the envelopes in front of you, guiding you through a series of challenges that will take you on a unique journey of discovery through Switzerland's breathtaking landscapes and cultures. The stakes are high, but so is the reward. Mm -hmm. The creator who wins the most challenges will have their work featured on a big screen in Times Square, New York. No way. <laughs> now grab your envelopes, your adventure, is about to begin. We got presents. Oh, that's a serious one. Oh, these are challenges. Oh, these are the challenges that we open on the day, right? So cool. See, I just immediately went with a gift, and you guys are out. I just, uh, I just can't work out where the waterfall is. Oh, it's right there. Uh, well, it's envelope time. Um, today we've got landscapes and colors. So let's see what this is about. I probably should have opened this before we decided to get the first bus up into the valley because, um, I don't know, there might be a stipulation saying no waterfalls, which would be a problem. But thankfully, it doesn't say that. It says, time to move. Find a colorful landscape and capture a photo where you are the moving the element, element within, within it. it. Use a self-timer, remote triggers, or, or help, help are not allowed. OK, that's really interesting. Hmm. OK, good. So today is a selfie day. <laughs> OK. Decisions, decisions. Right, so initial thought, I really want to use this village here, hopefully to frame the, uh, the waterfall. No idea yet how uh, I get myself into the shot, but yeah, I think that is the best way to add the most color into the scene. Definitely not what I'd usually spend my time doing. Hi. Hi, sorry to bug you. Um, so we're at Chateau Chillon. We were trying to ask them if we were able to get in and take some pictures, and they said we need a journalism pass to be able to do that. Um... OK, thank you. OK, bye. Ready? Let's see if it works. Do you want to go? Après vous? Yeah. Thank you. What could be really cute is if I put the tripod really low on the dock. I feel like I should take a couple more. Oh, I could sit. Okay. So right now we are hiking around the Rosenlaui Valley. This place is stunning. I mean, there's little huts everywhere. There's rivers, there's huge mountains above us and it's gorgeous, but I'm looking for that perfect location and wait for that really nice light to come in. If we find that location, we wait a little bit, we get good light, we can really win this challenge. Three, two, one, go. I want to get to that higher rock this time. 
Oh, that's cool. Right, well, we've got an opportunity for some movement in the form of this swing. One more time. Right, one last time. I think we got one. We're running out of time. I'm literally about to set behind the ridge. It's raining a lot outside and the prediction for the day is not looking good at all. And it's a day when the challenge is all about taking my own picture, keeping my camera out on a tripod and shooting. It is what it is, so... So this isn't what I thought it would be. I thought we would be able to go down, all the way down to the river. But So the only idea for a shot that I had is now... <laughs> is now gone. The shot idea looks fine, but the setting doesn't look so nice. Well, that's uh, a wrap for today, I think. I feel pretty good about how that challenge went. I think the, uh, the swing is a strong concept and I think it follows the brief very tightly. I just don't know which version I'm going to go for. I really vibed with the challenge today. I love shooting landscapes. That's something I really pride myself in. But I loved the added element of having to capture myself in motion. Took the first shot with my camera, with my big mirrorless. It was completely wet. Too much rain kind of forced us to go back. My GoPro came to my rescue and took one more shot. Am I happy? Not really. But the shots do look interesting, so I still have to go back and see how they are. There are definitely a few photos in there that I think turned out really well and definitely one that I'm going to submit. And I'm still so tired. Jet lag is hitting me so hard. I don't even know what day or time it is. I barely know my own name. So that's my disadvantage. So see you guys tomorrow. I got some seriously stiff competition up against me. Come on. I can't say I have ever taken a photo like this. That's amazing. It's just that the Matterhorn is currently hiding. What life choices led me to this moment, you know? Making sure not to fall off the cliff. <laughs>